guys, how's it going? It's Melanie, and today I'm here with Colin, and we are finally going to do the How Well Do You Know Each Other challenge that was recommended to me by a commenter that I can't remember right now, so my apologies. But, anywho, we are going to do the How Well Do You Know Each Other challenge, and to do this, we have our notebooks and our pens or pencils and we are going to write on the top half our answer for like what we think is their answer and then on the bottom half we are going to write our own answer so if the question were like what's their favorite color, you write their favorite color on the top and then your favorite color on the bottom so that you can know that you are right. And this is going to be the first time that either of us are seeing these questions. I'm just going to be looking at them on my phone and then we are both going to answer, not showing our answers until we are done. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the very first question is what is my favorite holiday? Holiday? Holiday. Ah, uh, well, this might be a bit of a toss-up for me. But I'll decide on one right now. Okay. Pencil might not have been the best choice for this. Well, you can obviously just tell what it is. Oh no. Um, this is going to be real hard. Right. No. Nah, huh? Can't figure it out? Uh, <laughs> I'm, Do you not know me? I'm probably the, wor the world's worst girlfriend, so mm. my apologies. It's debatable. Is it? Uh, no, I'm going to stick with my answer. Are you ready? Uh. Show it to the screen in like five seconds. One, two, three, four. Okay. Five. Okay. What, what you got, we... fam? Yay! Mm. Well, I'll count yours because I couldn't decide. I really like Halloween and Christmas a bunch. Top one though would be Halloween. For me, it's a bit of a toss-up. It, it used to be the 4th of July until they outlawed personal purchases of fireworks in our states without, in our state without a license. That's fair. I don't think I would have remembered that. Yeah. Just a, a little five-year-old me running around with throwing firecrackers. Definitely not the safest thing. Glad I still have all my fingers. Well, for now. Question two! Mm-hmm. Question two. And, because I feel like it's particularly needed to say for this one, although maybe that's me just trying to give myself a head start or a point. If you don't have one for these, any of these questions, you can just say, like, yeah, it doesn't count for me. Or, Not if you have multiple, then you can just be like, here's a couple and can give like one or a half point or whatever if you at least get part of it. And to reiterate, the score is now one to one, correct? Yes. One to one. Okay. Put it up on screen. Or, oh, or not. Probably just... not. <laughs> What's my favorite dessert? Oh. Ha ha. Oh, well. Is uh, all of the above an option? Well, it is. Yep. It's an option. Eh, well. <laughs> you ready? Ready whenever you are. Three, two, one. Boop, boop, Bing. Boop. And boop, boop, boop. Pumpkin pie is wrong. Um, my favorite dessert is cheesecake, but I guess I was also wrong. Cause I just put that you don't like sweets because anytime I try and give you sweets, you're like. I don't like sweets. Every time you try to give me sweets, I say, 
I'm on the diet. So I think you should lose one point. For that. <laughs> that's not fair. No, that's not how it works. Mm -hmm. Question number three. Well, still one for one, I guess. Oh well. Number three, let's go. Okay. You can do. Yeah, whatever. Okay. What's the one food I could never get sick of eating? Um. We can count just straight up brands if you would like. Like straight food up brands. Brands? Like food, fast food chains or like food chains or. Are you trying to give me a hint here? Uh, no. I'm not. I'm giving myself a hint. Um. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> <sighs> but there's so many things you could never, you could like have forever. Whatever, I have a specific one. Um, well, I have a pretty good guess, at least, and it's, it's going to be another one of those. Something tells me I, they're probably not going to be able to read this because I'm using pencil. Well, I'm not using the best writing, which is why we're staying our jeans, I think. Okay. Okay. Are you ready? Ready whenever you are. Okay. Three, two, one, flip. Bam! I said, Chiditos or Headwest for you. And mine, which I just told you like five days ago that I could eat this like five days in a row and not get tired of it, was the fried rice chicken type dish thing that I like to make for myself. Also, for those of you that don't know, Chiditos and Headwest are both um, food chains that are like only located back where we used to live. Exclusively in the Springfield, Illinois area. For the most part, I feel like I might have a couple situate uh, uh, locations outside of that city. Ch check them out, though. Yeah, uh, the uh, can't curse. Nope. <laughs> oh, so yeah, you get. <laughs> so you get two, and I get one. Ha! Ah, I'm winning. <sighs> I'm winning. Celebratory dab. Yeah. Hopefully. I know. Okay. I feel like I should at least get okay. a half okay. point. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, no. Yeah, fine. Oh. One and a half points for you. Okay. Where is the one place I would move to? Only one place? You have so many options, though. I really do. And, um, uh. I'm thinking of a specific one right now. Can we limit to... Can read my mind. Hmm. Are we limiting to, uh, like, in-country, or are we also including out-of-country? Um, we're including out-of-country. You can just stay a specific country if you like. And I'm gonna go ahead and list, like, two for you. So you can list multiple if you want. I'll put a couple on my own, because I don't have a one specific place that I would move to. I just have okay. a couple different places. Ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm so ready. You good, fam? Uh, I guess so. One, two, three, flip. Me. And I got. Oh. I was right because I said Ireland or Japan for him, and mine was Ireland, Japan, or Canada. And first of all, etc. does not count as an answer. That's. It's not the stupid. only thing I put down. Anywho, he had Japan and Ireland, which I had down on mine, so that counts. He also had California, which is true, but not what I listed. So that one doesn't count. But we both get one point, so that's three for me, and two and a half points for you. You gave me a half point? Yeah. Aww, thank you. So, the next question is... What is the top thing on my bucket list? Now, I don't know if you're actually making a bucket list. I have been working on my own, but I'm not going to go for like the literal top thing that's on mine because I don't even know what that is right offhand. So I'm just going to be super duper broad with this because... Oh, I'm being broad too. I know exactly what you... I know this. exactly. I got a broad spectrum answer that I know is going to be good. I, I got this. This is in the bag. Oh, really? Are you ready? 
Um, I need to think of what's mine. Though. What? I already have yours, though, so you must have yours. Um. Write a novel. Oh, I was wrong. But he was right. He got travel, which is what I really want to do. Does that, mean I'm, does that mean I'm now in the lead with my pity point? Do I get half a point because mine is also true for you and I gave you a half a point? Um, okay, we can tie it up. Three and a half! Two, three and a half. We're tied! Yay! We're tied. Okay. We love each other equally, which apparently isn't that much. Uh, actually. Not it! Oh, just kidding. We've only had like four questions. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Not as ready as I can be. Let's get it open. Oh. That sounds very enthusiastic. Okay. <laughs> um, what is my all time favorite movie? You should, you should get this time. though. You should probably get this. I don't know if I will. How about the next time we do a challenge like this, we, uh... What? <laughs> how about the next time we do a challenge like this, we, uh, invest in some Sharpies? We have Sharpies. Like, good ones. Big old blotter type. I went broad. You went broad? Broad. So broad. Okay. Wow. Ready, go! For him, I put anything scary. And he put... Saw. So that counts. Yeah. And he said... Halloween or Spider-Man Homecoming, which was my last minute thing to write down. I just put Spider-Man, but I obviously meant this last one. But feel like my main one was Kiki's Delivery Service. I feel like you kind of went for a cop-out answer there. What are you talking about? Anything scary? Fine, uh, half a point. It's okay. all scary. Well, I the, mean, not the, really anymore, but... Well, I do I get a point? A lot. Yeah, um... Do I have a full point, then? You wrote down Spider-Man, didn't you? Uh, I'll, I'll take a half a point. You get a full point because we both had it written down. It's just how it works, Colin. You can't okay. give yourself less points for being right. Okay. So now we are four to four and a half with Colin in the lead. What is your dream job? Dream job, huh? Yup, your dream job. Okay, well... Wow. I am all ready, ready. Really? So ready. Oh. So ready. I thought you were writing. Hmm. That's because you're talking. Okay. I went a little bit broad too, but also a little bit specific. Three, two, one, flip. Okay, so for him, I said a writer, which is a hundred points for me. And he said a crafter or baker or in general just making things. Now I said, own a bakery, so I will count that. Yay! So I'm in the lead with five, five and a half. Five, so five and a half. Are you ready for the next question? Ready to kick your butt? Heck yes. Okay. What language would I most like to be fluent in? Oh. Three, two, yep. one. Okay. Yay! Another one of these ones. Yay! I mean, you know, six to six and a half. I've also had, always had an interest in learning Russian. No particular reason, it just felt like a fun language to learn. That would be cool. Okay, Diana. are you are you ready? Certainly. Ready? How many more questions do we have? I left? don't know. Who knows? You organized this well, didn't you? Oh. What is something that cheers me up when I am sad? Three, two, one, go. Uh, oh, I did! Okay. No, but you were wrong. I said food for mine. I like food. He said a hot shower or bath and or coffee. And originally I just put me for him and he said video games. But I'm pretty sure he cheated and saw my answer. No, I so just put guessed. me. I just guessed because I thought... I just guessed because I thought I caught that little cheeky tone in your voice there. Uh, uh, you knew what you were going for. It's like, oh, I, I don't think I can cheer him up when he's in a bad mood. <laughs> but I'm going to answer it anyway and make him look like an asshole. Oh, uh, well. So, yeah, I'm going to give you half a point on that. So, we're neck and neck again. Six and a half to six and a half. 
Sounds good. Okay, next one. What is my favorite book or book series? Yay! Yay! High five! Hey, High five for slowly becoming the same person. For real. Like, probably honestly. So, now we are tied with seven and a half points. And I think we'll just make it whoever gets the 10 first wins. Just because when is our anniversary? It's a test question to see if okay. he knows. Are you ready? Uh -huh. Did you cheat? No, because I already finished. Okay. Three, two, one. Boop. Bam! What'd you say? You gotta put the year two. Don't look on by. You said July 4th, not July 4th, 1987. <laughs> Fine, whatever. You yeah. get the point. It was 2, 12, 12. Uh, she's, trying to throw me, she's trying to throw me off here, trying to get ahead. I need to be ahead. Maybe I, I should choose the next question. Nuh uh. What flavor of ice cream is my favorite? Ice cream uh, flavor. What flavor is my favorite? Okay. Three, two, one, go. Ah. Okay. Pumpkin is a really good ice cream. I actually do love pumpkin ice cream. I said the Halo Top brand oatmeal cookie ice cream because that's really good. Okay. You said bunny tricks and I said the gelato brand or whatever. That is, caramel. that is one that I've liked recently, but I didn't put it down because it wasn't my all-time favorite. I used to get bunny tracks, well, like, blue bunny brand bunny tracks. What other you know, kind of brand is there of bunny tracks? Cause, not, hashtag not sponsored. Um, hashtag sponsored. Please. Please, <laughs> oh God. No. We I'm need just, that money. Nah, fam. Mm -hmm. I'm good. But yeah, that's like my favorite since I was a little kid. Okay, well, I'm gonna give you a half point for being right because I really love pumpkin ice cream and I have been talking about that a lot lately. So it makes sense that he would get it. So we are at seven and a half to eight. What is the first thing I liked about you? My style. Okay. Like, yeah, I really liked, the, I really liked the, I, I think I might have mixed this up. It's like the first thing. I put at the bottom, what I put at bo the bottom is the first thing I liked about you, and what you put at the, what I put at the top is the first thing you liked about me. I know. Correct? Um, yes. And so I said that he would have liked my eyes, but obviously wrong, but my style is pretty awesome. And I said the first thing I liked about him was doubt booty. Because <laughs> he had a really nice butt. But, but he said my Facebook, to his pro Facebook profile, and that... Doesn't count. Next question. <laughs> what helps me fall asleep the best? The thing that helps me fall asleep best is a cat, like he said. <laughs> For him, I said either laying perfectly still because he always says, Oh no, you can easily fall asleep if you just stop fidgeting and just lay still. Or reading stuff on his phone. Because he likes to do that a whole, whole bunch before he goes to bed. But he said a podcast, which is also true. Yeah, I guess, uh, I guess I'm guess at uh, nine, and do you want a half point? Because you're technically correct, but maybe. No, that's okay. Okay, so it's nine to seven and a half. You better catch it. Pick up the pace here, otherwise you might lose. Gonna find the best question out of this whole list. Yeah. What is my guilty pleasure snack? I don't think you feel guilty about anything you snack on. Well, you freaking better freaking figure something out. He said, late night McDonald's. No. I don't feel guilty about anything I eat. Oh, come on. I thought we had to I'm at least so choose no, something. No, uh-uh, no. That's not fair. No, uh because I told you in, like, the second question for the what's my favorite dessert that you could say not applicable. And you said, yeah, okay. Mm. So, it counts. And he said cookie dough. 
I said sweets. I think that should get like at least half a point because obviously cookie dough is sweet. Sure. What's my go-to Netflix show slash movie? Okay. Go-to Netflix show or movie. Good deal. Go! She got. He's got Futurama, which is the thing I ended up going with. Not that I've been watching it lately on Netflix because yeah. I took off like all first six seasons and I was just starting season five, so I haven't watched it in a really long time. But that was my most recent go to thing to watch on Netflix. And I put. He put Full Little up. Alchemist Brotherhood. And I just said Marvel TV shows because. I noticed a lot of the times, not even just Marvel, he was watching Gotham and like Flash and all that stuff. So Colin I wins! That. But yeah, Colin wins. Um, 10 points for him. I had 8. Oh. Okay, so Colin won this challenge and good for him. He didn't have any prizes to win. Um, so that sucks for him. He didn't really win anything except for the fact that he apparently knows me better. So that's cool. Um, if you guys liked the video, let me know by leaving a thumbs up. Comment with any future suggestions you have. If you want to see more challenges like this, let me know. Solo challenges, couple challenges, challenges with friends. I am all ears for any of those things. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. See ya.